In this example, we will be explaining the wrapping words functionality within Cameo, as well as showing the default styles and how to change that. So we'll get started. We have a block definition diagram and three blocks with really long names. So you can see that it might be helpful to go on a second line here, but uh, it won't let you drag the name onto the second line as it currently sits. So what you would do is you select the block itself, go to symbol, and you can scroll down to wrap words and then change that to true. And now you have the ability to make it smaller. Additionally, if you change it back, it will lock it back to one line. So we'll change it back to uh, wrapped like that. And this one is, these both are, the default is to have the wrapped word set to false. And we'll explain how to change that in a minute because it can be kind of cumbersome if you've got a lot of blocks with long names that you're going to be having, you maybe you just want to have the default set to allowing the wrapped words. But uh, if, if you've just got one specific diagram and you want wrapped words, you can just select all of them like that. Or you could do an alt select, which would select all of the blocks. And then you could just uh, change this to true. And then you can resize all of your blocks like that. So we'll... Uh, change this one to false just for now. And um, we can show that this is the new block, new block on screen. It is currently defaulted to having a second line. Um, so I already have changed the default, but what we'll do is we'll change it back to defaulting to one line. So again, if I'm adding a new block, it defaults to allowing you to uh, go to that second line. So if you go to uh, Options, Project, and then you go to Symbol Styles, and you select, you type in Block uh, to the search there. And you can select Class because Block is a type of class. And you can scroll down and find the wrapped words. So the wrapped words default is set to true right now. And if I hit Reset Defaults, um, wrapped words. Okay, we'll just set it to false right here. And then we'll select OK. So now we've saved a new set of defaults. So now when I add a new block, it defaults to one line. And to change that back, options, project, Hit symbol styles, type in block, uh, class is a type of block, and you can scroll down to wrapped words, make that true, select OK, and now our default is set to two plus lines. So, hope this example helped.